they are the soldiers of immunity um, which we develop uh, which we are able to develop following uh, vaccination so that will be able to address the mutants as well The vaccine that India has developed, I am particularly talking about Covaxin, which is a whole variant killed uh, virus based vaccine that presents to the immune system a wide array of antigens. So the immunity which will be produced following vaccination are expected to, you know, all the, it's not just one protein, it's a, an array of proteins and a range of cell, they are the soldiers of immunity um, which we develop, uh, which we are able to develop following uh, vaccination. So that will be able to address the mutants as well. So I'm not tremendously worried and we do not have any scientific evidence as yet to say mm -hmm. that the mutants are really uh, going to challenge the efficacy of the vaccine. Hard immunity produced by vaccines is a good idea but then again we, as we have talked about the mutations, mm -hmm. when they change themselves, the immunity might not be working against the new mutant, mm -hmm. uh, even if it is a small mutation, like drifts. Mm -hmm. Indian program has actually taken a smart vaccination approach rather than mass vaccination approach. Both Covaxin and Covishield, they are safe. So there is not an iota of doubt or um, uh, there should not be an iota of pessimism or apprehension in terms of the safety. Both the vaccines have been found to be safe enough to be, to be taken. So if you tell me when are you going to get your shot, I will say I will wait for my call. Whatever is allotted to me, I will take it. Because both are not only safe but also immunogenic and both have received uh, from the highest um, regulatory authority in India which is DCGI. Drug Controller General of India have received the mm, uh, emergency use authorization. So I would say that there is no need for any anxiety, fear, hesitation around vaccine um, administration. So uh, people should feel safe and there should not be any rumors going around um, and uh, everybody should feel encouraged to take it. I, I think it's not appropriate to uh, spread rumors. Uh, we should all try to dispel the myths and misconceptions around these two vaccines, which we have now ready at hand. And uh, that's what I would uh, have as a message uh, for people. In older days, it would take 20 to 30 years to get a vaccine out, in, or for that matter, any medicine or drug or a vaccine out in the market for use. Now, since uh, the the uh, knowledge about the whole genome of the virus SARS-CoV-2 mm -hmm. which causes COVID-19 within 10 to 12 months time the vaccine has come out um, in place and this underlines I'm talking about Covaxin which has been um, produced by ICMR Bharat Biotech collaboration mm -hmm. A completely indigenous initiative and this has happened within 10 to 12 months of knowing the genome sequence. This clearly underlines the superiority, the ability and the commitment of the scientists of India and I would say that it's phenomenal.